वेलकम बैक टू तपस्या यूट्यूब चैनल के टुडे अवर टॉपिक इज केमिकल रिएक्शन एंड इक्वेशन के बिफोर गोइंग टू डिफाइन वट इज केमिकल रिएक्शन वट इज इक्वेशन के बिफोर गोइंग टू दैट वी हैव टू नो अबाउट चेंजेस अराउंड अस के सो मेनी चेंजेस टेक्स प्लेस अराउंड अस के दैट मे बी कैटेगराइज एज नैचुरल चेंज के मैन मेड चेंज टेम्पररी एंड परमानेंट चेंजेस के दीज आर द चेंजेस ऑफ कर इन अवर डे टू डे लाइफ इन अवर सराउंडिंग के नाउ टेम्पररी चेंज के वॉट इज टेम्पररी चेंज के टेम्पररी मीन्स देर इज नो चेंज इन कॉम्पोजिशन इफ कॉम्पोजिशन विल चेंज के दट इज लीड्स टू परमानेंट चेंज के टेम्पररी मीन्स देर इज नो चेंज इन द कॉम्पोजिशन Okay, suppose to explain temporary change, we have to take some water in a beaker, is keep in fridge for a day. Yes, then that water is becomes to solid or converts into solid form. Yes, this solid you have to make it heat. then what it converts as it converts as liquid is keep again continuously heat after it's reaching to 100 degree centigrade is some vapors are comes out it means here what is the changes water is converted into ice ice is converted into liquid then after it's converted into what vapor it means what changes takes place here only changes takes place physical only physical change takes place okay there is no change in composition okay that's why it is what temporary change now come to the point of permanent change okay permanent change see some examples here ke okay, milk is converted into curd it is permanent change because initially milk it is converted into curd ke okay, there is no relation to the curd and milk there is no equal composition Yes, composition is different. Milk composition is different. Curd composition is different. Okay, that's why this is a permanent change. Okay, when we are taking the food, after three to four hours, it is going to get digested. Okay, this also one of the permanent change. Okay, grapes get fermented, fermentation. Okay, that's all. That also one of the permanent change. Okay, iron, which is exposed to humidity. Okay, it's getting rusted. Okay, means its uh, composition can be changes. Okay, crackers burn. Okay, we respire. When we respire, we are taking oxygen. Yes, we are giving what carbon dioxide. Yes, initial and final. Okay, both are not equal. Okay, that's why it is what one of the permanent change. Okay, coal is burn. Okay, this also what permanent change. Yes, in permanent change, what is the changes takes place here? Composition is change. Okay, not physically. Here change takes place chemically. Okay, that's why it is what permanent change. Yes, where there are chemical change takes place, you can say their chemical reaction occurred. how do we come to know where chemical reaction occurred okay to know about that okay we have to do some activities okay first activity take a beaker is in the beaker have to take calcium oxide to calcium oxide add H2O. Water have to add. 
कि व्हेन वी आर एडिंग द वाटर यस व्हिच इज गिविंग कैल्शियम हाइड्रोक्साइड व्हिच इज गिविंग कैल्शियम हाइड्रोक्साइड यस आफ्टर द रिएक्शन इफ यू टच द बीकर यस व्हाट विल हैपेंस यू फील हीट when heat is produces yes what is the conclusion we have to give heat produce heat produce okay that heat is given evolved where there are heat is evolved we can call it as exothermic reaction Okay, where heat is taken, okay, that is endothermic reaction. Yes, by this experiment, we got heat produced. Heat is given or releases. Okay, that's why. Okay, that you can call as exothermic reaction. While chemical reaction, heat is produced okay this we can say as one of the chemical reaction okay one more example we have to give take a clean magnesium ribbon it is a magnesium ribbon yes to rub it with sand paper after rubbing with sand paper yes you have to take spirit lamp make it burn okay we should not touch with our fingers yes we have to take tong with the tong you have to keep it and expose to the fire expose to the flame case yes, when it is exposed to the flame okay which is burn brightly it means it is giving ash okay that you have to collect in this okay what you are taken here magnesium ribbon is yes, magnesium ribbon burn with oxygen okay what it is giving which is giving magnesium oxide as powder which is given what powder yes what is the conclusion we have to give here okay this is one form powder is another form okay change takes place in the physical state change takes place in what physical state okay this is one more example okay third example we have to give for chemical change is occurred yes let us do another experiment here take a beaker yes in the beaker we have to take potassium lead nitrate sorry lead nitrate Yes, to the lead nitrate, have to add potassium iodide. What we have to add? Potassium iodide. Yes, when you are adding potassium iodide, here one of the compound is formed. Okay, that is lead iodide and potassium nitrate. potassium nitrate okay here what is the formation of lead nitrate lead iodide is ppt precipitate is formed okay precipitate means which is remain in the chemical reaction okay that we can call as what precipitate okay which is in yellow color yellow color Yes, here what you have to say conclusion PPT is forms. Okay, to know about one more example we have to give for the chemical reaction. See, take a conical flask. Take a conical flask. In the conical flask. I have to take zinc granules. 
is to the ginkgo granule you have to add hydrochloric acid HCl you have to add when reaction takes place between zinc and HCl okay which is giving to us okay ZnCl2 plus H2 gas okay what it is given gas is given what it's given gas is given while chemical reaction heat produced while chemical reaction physical state is changed while chemical reaction precipitate is formed while chemical reaction gas is evolves yes during the chemical reaction okay there takes place permanent change okay all the situation the initial and final not a same product okay there will be the different products okay all this comes to know it's gives to explanation to about it chemical okay by that experiments we will give conclusion okay original substance lost their characteristic properties while chemical reaction their loss their original characteristics okay initial substance is very different and final substance is different okay chemical change may be exothermic and endothermic okay, while chemical reaction there heat is evolved or absorbs okay they may be gas evolved yes h2 gas is evolved yes they may form an insoluble substance that we are calling as precipitate yes while chemical reaction these are the changes take earlier we discussed about chemical reaction chemical reaction means chemical change takes place where chemical reaction is occurred that is chemical reaction now chemical equations as yes, once you remember recall that activity when calcium hydroxide is reacts with water what it is given calcium hydroxide okay that we have to write in shortest form okay shortest written form we have to write okay i am writing shortest written form as calcium calcium oxide which is reacts with water okay which given calcium hydroxide okay that activity i written shortest written form yes in this what are present okay what this represents look at here calcium water is undergoes reaction calcium hydroxide is formed new substance in this activity calcium oxide and water is undergoes chemical reaction calcium hydroxide is formed as the new substance now where there are undergoes chemical reaction that we can call as reactants okay this also involved in the reaction this also what reactant now formed a new substance that is what product now here calcium hydroxide and water are reactants now what is the product is form calcium hydroxide is what product in chemical equation okay there should be reactants and products are present okay reactants are in left hand side reactants are in left hand side now products are in right hand side now Okay, two reactants are separated by plus sign. 
okay reactants and product is separated by arrow mark okay this arrow marks gives direction of reaction yes where there are more than two products here only one product is there some reactions okay there will be more than one product okay we can call it as by product okay by product also can be separated by plus sign okay this is about chemical equation in written form yes more than written form okay there should be a chemical formula it has to write in the shortest path more than shortest path that is chemical formula now words has to converted into chemical formula now we have to write it as calcium hydroxide i am writing in the symbolic form calcium oxide okay water symbolic form h2o is calcium hydroxide symbolic form caoh calcium hydroxide now it is more precious than written form it is the shortest path of in the written form okay, it is what symbolic form okay this is chemical reaction in the chemical reaction reactants are there and product is there okay, reactants are left side of the arrow mark product is right side of the arrow mark okay two reactants can be separated by plus sign yes product direction shows gives rise to it is the product if two products are present okay that we can separate it by plus sign okay this is chemical equation